Health Minister Chitaru Chilufia says Zambia will continue to focus on escalating the capacity to screen and test for COVID-19 so as to curb the further spread of the disease. Dr. Chilufia says the ministry has trained health personnel to enhance the fight against COVID-19. He said this during the COVID-19 update where he announced that the country has recorded five new cases of over 900 out of over 900 tests conducted in the last 24 hours with three recoveries ruth china reports the task to save lives is harder and a risky one but they still turn up and execute their duty with the escalation in mass screening and testing for covid 19 the need for increased number of health personnel is inevitable we have trained more personnel in various sectors of government including the private sector to ensure that sample collection and packaging infection prevention and control appropriate use of ppes and data management is enhanced dr chulufia also disclosed that out of over 900 tests conducted in the last 24 hours the country has recorded five new positive cases and three people recovering these cases include contacts to known cases persons screened and tested during the community surveillance in Lusaka and Kafue and a foreign truck driver. He also said the ministry is saddened by the death of one of the health personnel, Ian Mutambo, who was on the power to bus on Saturday. Allow me to express our heartfelt condolences and commiserations to the family and friends of our beloved. We also remember the three other victims. While an investigation will be done to establish all the facts. Preliminary, you should note that it isn't the first time that samples for surveillance are being transported by public transport. And as the press celebrate the day, Dr. Chilufia praised the media for the role they have played in the COVID-19 fight. We applaud your solidarity as we fight side by side, pushing back the franchise of COVID-19 without fear or favor, but with caution. You too are our heroes and heroines, and we'll ensure that you too are protected as you carry out your responsibilities at the front line. You deserve a big round of applause. Health Permanent Secretary Kennedy Malama also explained how the ministry is managing the distribution of donations. Previously, we've updated you that a total of 1.154 million kwacha was received as cash. But this money was deposited in the central account at Ministry of Finance in line with the regulations. And those resources have been used. So it's important to note that we are fighting COVID-19. The needs are so huge, the resources which are coming in are really being applied immediately they are received. Health authorities have continued to encourage the public to adhere to the regulations put in place to stay safe. Ruth Chainda, NBC News, Lusaka. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe.